daughter of a federal judge, ODs on a drug called Hard Rock. And now this judge wants to crack down on the sale of illegal narcotics in his city. This is what it took for my man to finally start doing his freaking job in Hard Rock from Lionsgate. On these streets, we're born alone, we die alone. Police suspect that several recent deaths may be the result of adulterated heroin. District Judge's daughter was found dead. Our brand has been compromised. These drugs are an epidemic. The people who peddle this evil poison must be stopped. If you want to survive a week from today, you help me get to the bottom of this. Capiche? Hard Rock, Papa. That's what it is. Hard Rock. She never had a chance. It wasn't all day. Here she comes. This cat's trying to get you. Who won't help you? Everybody! They turned on us. Shoot me, Frank! When you get caught in deep depths, you kind of learn how to swim. Let us recognize that Hard Rock does have some issues. The story jumps around a little bit too much, so we're never quite sure what's going on. The acting, at times, is a little suspect. Well, a lot of the times, it's a little suspect. It picks up points that it never revisits, which, again, leaves us wondering what's going on. And if you have a girlfriend who's always asking you questions like, hey, baby, where did you hide the drugs? Or, hey, baby, what time is the drop off? Or, hey, baby, what's the name of your contact? Then I'm thinking there might be a little something up with your girlfriend. But the movie is not without its charms. Unlike our last movie, it didn't cover up its many hot women in flannel. The story wasn't bad, and there was plenty of action in. I can't think of anything else. But what I can tell you is by the time the final credits roll in Hard Rock, I kind of enjoyed this movie, despite as many flaws. Kind of a lot, actually. Hard Rock. Who's with?